So I know, Bill, you wanted to talk a little bit about this idea of the pause, but before you do, could you just differentiate or connect this concept of trigger versus activation for us? Yeah, yeah I'm glad you brought it up, Lavinia. That it was the alternative we were searching for too triggered, A, because we didn't like the gun <laughs> metaphor, and, and B, because it tends to imply that reactions are big and fiery and that's not and attacking case. and attacking and that's not the case always in fact from personal experience i know that <laughs> my activation usually is to shut down and get cold, you know, and withdraw. And so that does not, you know, that doesn't seem like a triggered reaction. So we wanted to find a term that applied to all, all different kinds of reactions to threat. And um, so we liked activation because it just implies that our nervous system is getting activated. And then we go down the path of defense that appeals to us because of our history and our personality. And I wanted to, to stick on what you said from the book about that the activation actually lasts 90 minutes, 90 seconds, seconds right? <laughs> oh my gosh, 90 <laughs> minutes. <laughs> well, it can sometimes last more than 90 yeah, minutes. 90 if, days. 90 days, right. But I think that the piece, the, the, the diagram that is in, in what we just showed, where it says, or we could keep it going by judgmental thoughts. And I think that that's a very key point, which right. is, do we want to keep the activation going with self-righteousness and judgment and rah, and I'm going to do it, or we can choose to use something like circles of compassion to calm our system down. And we have a choice, which we sometimes don't realize we have a choice, but we do have a choice. Mm -hmm.